This is the mirror cube. You're not gonna believe how the bathroom works on this thing. So this is us after just arriving from our millionth hour flight to the middle of nowhere in Sweden. You can tell we filmed this before the world shut down though, because of all the snow. Yeah. Oh, gosh dang it. <laughs> and this is what you call ice. Wow, the Sweden exclusive. Okay, well, now we have that out of the way, it's time for a two and a half hour drive to the tree hotel in Norsk. I don't, know. I don't know how to say any of these things. We soon discovered along the way that Sweden's pristine powder snow is actually a dog's favorite place to take a piss. P mark, P mark, what? P mark, P mark. What the? What? P mark, there's P everywhere. Some serious territory marking going on here. This is P central right here. This is all we're seeing is cute little Swedish buildings. Uh, and P, go ahead to those people, we can ask them. Excuse me, we're looking for a gas station. Is there a gas station nearby? Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Yeah. I should have asked for the P marks, but I, I lost my courage. <laughs> because... No, no, I'm glad you did it. <laughs> Today we're going to be surviving, roughing it in this invisible hotel suspended deep in the Swedish forest. I see you. Oh my gosh, Tree Hotel, there it is. Oh, and we <laughs> and we passed turn. There it is, dude, Tree Hotel. Knock, knock, knock. Date of arrival, what's the date today? The 8th of March. Okay, so we've checked in now and uh, got the keys to our mirror cube. It's a little bit of a walk, apparently. They have a sauna, maybe we can try later. We have a three course meal tonight, they said. So our room apparently is out there in the woods. 500 meters though, so it shouldn't be too far. You mean half a kilometer? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know what this reminds me of? Narnia. Check it out! There's a giant. Sea can in the, in the trees. What's a sea can? Oh, that looks so cool. I wish we had booked a night in all of these. My Apple Watch just told me. You want to record this? Yes, I would. <laughs> oh my goodness, here it is, David. Wow. Wow. How clear it is. How clear? <sighs> yeah, one second. Wow. It's kind of small. I mean, you know. I was just thinking. <laughs> it's a. Uh, well, it looks a little bigger than I thought. Oh, really? Yeah. The Mirror Cube offers excellent accommodation for two people with a double bed, bathroom, lounge, and rooftop terrace. What? That sounds a lot. <laughs> All in there? That's not that big. <laughs> Let's check it out. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to the Mirror Cube. Here. How was I, your trip? I'm just curious about how we're both staying here, so I'm you know <laughs> I'm just behind the camera. But yeah, no, this looks cool. Show me around it. What does this place have to offer? First thing you notice when you walk in, you might have noticed it smells a lot of wood. Come on in, come oh, on. Oh yes, oh uh, yes, okay. It's pretty spacious in here, I would say. Outside there's mirrors. Inside there is wood. Yes. Like we established. And a real tree. Is this do you think? The only thing holding us up, it's a little bit scary. <laughs> also, uh, giant cables uh, yes. that uh, hold any position, but this still rocks a lot. I'm worried about being seasick. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it's not a problem. Like I've never been seasick before. I've been um, seasick. Oh, no way. I tell you, it's not pretty. It's very ugly. But we'll see what happens. <laughs> or flashbacks. We've become literal tree <laughs> I feel like this is a nice little home we could just live in here. I'm, I'm, I'm it's liking it. It's very cozy, it's very warm. The bathroom is insane. Okay. I'll show you in a second. Walk us through the features, David. What, do we, what does this place have to offer? Okay, first of all, uh, did I mention it has a lot of wood? Yeah, we, we okay, got okay. yeah, we got we got past uh, that part. Uh, yeah. Heater here, you got an AC here, you got big windows that don't actually let you see inside. Yeah, which so is they're like double -sided the double-sided windows. Window ever. Now, right now we arrived yes. at like 4 p.m. and it's already you know getting dark yeah, out. Kind of dark, so, so now, as now you can we see, only see our own there's nothing out there. Pressing that reflection. <laughs> but during the day, these are actually giant windows, and there's a bunch of them. Plenty of windows in here. That's one of the Plenty questions we had. Another question out, that I had sure was, did. how do you have a bathroom in tree? Is it possible to have a bathroom in tree? The answer is yes. Here's the thing. There's a bathroom, but there's no running water. More on that later. <laughs> we <laughs> got amazing Whoa, architect, what is this? Act architect books. Dude, so I wonder, this is some sort of architectural feat, I'm assuming, to actually oh, build absolutely. this in the trees. If you know something about uh, the Swedish, is they're very tuned with art and lines and perfect uh, golden ratio. Right. I hear that's a thing. Sounds fancy. There's also a mini fridge. There's also 
these very uh, comfortable chairs, very Scandinavian, of course. You can oh, yes. see that IKEA influence. Mm. Or is it the other way around? I don't know. We also yeah. order a bowl of fruit. Fruit and chocolate, dude. We're living on luxury up here in this treehouse in Sweden, dude. After the tour is over. Let's save the toast for the end. Finish the tour. Where do we sleep, David? This is where we sleep. It's okay. A very cozy. Ooh. A little coffee hole here. Uh, you're cold? No, never. With this amazing wool. Mm. I don't know. It's a blanket. <laughs> we have a blanket. Uh, we got a bed. Dude sleeps too. Here, lay down there, David. I want to see how much space yes. we have. How much space do we have here? <sighs> Plenty of space. I'm actually very impressed with how much space is in this uh, cube because on the outside it looks quite small. Ugh. As MKBHD would Ugh. say, good use of space. Yes. Oh, this is nice. This is very nice. Uh, did I show you the wood? We've been, yeah, we've been okay. through the wood. Follow <laughs> me. Okay. Second floor. Ugh. It's actually a bit very dark out. It's now. very dark out. Oh my. This is gonna be a great video. This is so cool. <laughs> what? It's such a ha nice hangout spot. Look at this. Got, you can't even see it. Yeah, you can't see. Look, look, what? It's me. Whoa. Oh, that's what fingerprints are from. Me, 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 me. Yo, we're gonna get some trippy shots here. <laughs> right now, I guess it's a bit unusable. Yeah, well, uh, there's a bit. There is. But there's a little bit of snow. <laughs> when you come here in the spring. Experience a bit of a size envy. Size envy? Oh, what? Dude, check that place out. Okay, you know what we have to do, dude? Smash that like button if you want us to come back here and check out the rest of all the places, dude. If this gets to 100,000 likes, we'll come back. 100,000 likes and we'll come and check out all of the rooms here. Dude, check over there. What is that? No, no, no. <laughs> That's, uh... Stay tuned. <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> Subscribe. Smash that like button. So we can confirm it is mirror on top as well. <laughs> Nice it up. Well, what is this? Is this like the, the furnace of some kind? Yeah, I think so. Nice. Now, I told you before about the bathroom. Yes. Now, let's show you the bathroom. All right, here we go. Who would have thought you could still have a work, fully functioning bathroom inside a treehouse? All right. So first off, we start having, this is how you clean your hands. It's actually a very effective system. You just, Whoa. That is the system, most man. unique latch. And then you got something we call Cinderella. Explain this to me. The way this works, I guess we're just gonna show them, right? Yeah. So what happens is... Uh, so you take a small uh, little piece of paper, it opens up, you put it into the uh, toilet like that, and then, you know, you do your business, and it flushes away and actually burns. Take that, close it up, do your thing, and when you're done, you just hit start here, and, and it, it will proceed to incinerate. Burn <laughs> your... <laughs> we can't we can't we say can't, that as a family friendly show David. Uh, so you remember that uh, exhaust pipe? Yeah. Well, that's uh, where all the fumes go uh, from uh, the burning and it's very efficient. It's like uh, nothing was ever there. Damn. And there you go. Fully functioning. We Absolutely. have water, we have bathroom. We even have Wi-Fi in this in Oh this, yeah, in we do have Wi-Fi. The coronavirus <laughs> is everywhere. Especially <laughs> toilets. Also, wash <laughs> your phone. You know how filthy those things are? When Dude, was the last time you washed your phone? That's so true. When, when does anyone ever wash their phone? Damn. Me, all the time. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, this oh. is actually very good. It's like an explosion in my mouth. It's a very nice little, you know, room we get to eat in. We have a, a three-course meal coming and a wine menu. English. I understand what that says. All right, finally going to check out the sauna. I'm hey, hyped. Bob. It's been a long day and we haven't got a chance to check it out yet. Um, it's also freezing out, so it's gonna be so nice to jump in the hot tub. David, wait, David, David, wait, wait, wait is that him? What the? What? Where'd he go? Where'd he go?